Images are vital part of any web pages and images make the web pages load slowly if not properly optimized. Some people use some plugin or some third party services to optimize the images. I use a lot of images on all of my blog posts. You see on positivegeek.com I use a lot of pictures, lot of images, screenshot to explain the guides I want. So if the images are not properly optimized, not properly compressed, the page will load slow and it will affect the SEO also, right? So today we'll see how to uh, compress or optimize the images without any plugin or without any third party services. So for that, you have to open a website called Scoos, S Q U O O S H dot A P P. This website lets you compress and optimize your images resize your images for free this is an open source image compression tool created by google chrome labs here either you can upload an image or you can paste it from the clipboard let's select an image from the computer click here and select we have a screenshot here pg screenshot from the positivegeek.com and here you see the slider at the middle of the page this slider means at the right side of the slider you see the image after compression after the optimization you see the original picture the first option you will see here is resize so if you select resize you can resize the picture you can add a custom width and height but let's try with 1000 width and the height is automatically uh, entered because the maintain aspect ratio is turned on if you turn this off you can enter custom height here like 600 like this and you are seeing this picture here too much compressed because uh, the picture is zoomed in according to the height and width so we have to reduce it like this and you will see the actual picture here maybe it should be like this and you will see the exact optimization and exact quality of the picture after downloading the image okay so you can uh, compress the picture here for this tutorial we don't want to resize it here you can resize if you want our main uh, goal is to compress the image so if you select here the extension you get um png jpg webp and some other extension but uh, for wordpress website webp is the best extension you can use on your wordpress website right and google page speed inside also suggests images to be in webp format i'm talking about the google page speed if i search for google page speed i'll see this page speed tool here you can uh, paste your url and analyze the website or analyze the picture on the web pages you will see it will suggest you to convert the picture into webp and we are going to do this without any plugin by manually adding the webp picture after conversion right and when you select webp you can control the quality of the picture here when you drag this quality you will see the, the estimated output of file size here and you can also control the effort here but webp you don't need to touch the effort thing you can just control the quality the if i see the original picture is 287 kb but the after compression it will be 82.9 kilobyte right you can always drag this and see how it will look before and after compression if you make it bigger and see here the logo how it looks you can see the difference before and after difference you can adjust this quality accordingly it is up to you how do you want to um, make the picture okay and if you select the advanced setting here you will get some other options you can play around with this uh, I do not do anything with this advanced settings. I just come here and convert my pictures to WebP before uploading to any other page. And you can also rotate the picture to upside, downside, right, left if you need to, right? This is uh, basically this is a small image optimization image editor online. So the image is compressed. Now if you click this download button, it will be downloaded. And see the output is 104 kilobyte the original picture is 287 it is a webp file if you select here and select the properties you see the format is webp let's see if we can upload this picture on our wordpress website if we create a new page here add a new page and add an image 
media library upload files this is the original picture and this is the webp file we have just converted and if you see here this is the webp format here and select it and you can see the quality of the screenshot wordpress supports webp format and this is the best image format you should use on your wordpress website this is available for free you can convert any pictures before uploading to your wordpress website not only wordpress website you can up convert any picture optimize any picture you want to if you need for something other purpose you can convert them to um, jpg to can png some avif if you need any of this format you can use this course tool i'll link this uh, tool in the video description this is a very useful tool so i thought to share it with my viewers if you find this video helpful please like the video and share it to the people who may need it and please subscribe to the channel to help me grow the channel and of course visit positivegeek.com to get more useful articles thank you for watching